Hello everyone, welcome to the Bug Expert channel. In this video, we will talk about solutions for friends who encounter the Resident Evil 4 Remake Fatal D3D error. The general reason for this error is due to the fact that the graphics card is out of date. Of course, you may encounter such an error not only because of this problem, but also because of many problems. For this, we will try to solve the problem by telling you a few suggestions. The fact that the graphics card is not up to date causes you to encounter various errors like this. For this we will need to check if the graphics card is up to date. You can download the graphics driver by accessing the appropriate link for your graphics card in the article. Once the download is complete, access the app and verify if a new update is available. If a new update is available, download it and restart the computer by performing the installation process. The lack of game frameworks on your computer can create various errors in the game. Therefore, your computer must have DirectX, .NET Framework, VC Redist applications. Download and install the libraries in order by accessing the links in the article. If VC Redist is already installed on your computer, you can repair it. After the installation is complete, you can check by restarting the computer. You may encounter such an error because your device's system is insufficient for the game. For that, lower the graphics settings. Also, reach the graphics settings as I show in the picture, set the ray tracing option to off and save. Then check if the problem persists. We can eliminate the problem by using the startup options available on Steam. Access the library menu by opening the Steam application. Then right click on the Resident Evil 4 Remake game and access the properties menu. Edit the launch options option in the new window that opens with the code we left in the article and start the game. If the first code did not work, enter the second code and run the game again and check. Not starting the game as an administrator can cause you to encounter various problems like this. First, access the file directory where the game is installed. Then right click on the RE4 application and access the properties menu. Then click on compatibility option and enable run this program as administrator option. Press the apply button to save the setting and check by running the game through Steam. In such various memory errors, you can reach the solution of the problem by increasing the virtual memory. In the start search screen, type view advanced system settings and open it. Click the settings button under performance in the new window that opens. Then uncheck automatically manage paging file size for all drives. Select the system disk located below. Then select the custom size option. Let's set the initial size and maximum size option located below. For this we will need to calculate with a calculator. First check how many gigabytes of RAM we have. Since my RAM is 8 gigabytes, I will multiply 1024 by 8. If it were 16 gigabytes, I would multiply 16 by 1024. This value is in megabytes. Then let's multiply the megabyte value by one and a half and write the result in the initial size option. To adjust the maximum size, 
multiply the megabyte value of your RAM memory by 3 and write the result. Then click the set button to perform the addition process. After the process is complete, you can restart the computer and check if the problem persists. Yes, in this video we have provided information on how to fix Resident Evil 4 Remake Fatal D3D Error. If the problem persists, you can comment on the video.